gem lit. And then I need two fluid cables, which I have here. I just have one of them. That's a kind of a bummer. I can probably make some more though. If I do like this, that works. Nice. Here we go. This is the, this is the ME drive. This is where all the storage is gonna go. But as you see, it needs USB port. It needs USB sticks to get the storage. So what we need for that is a 1K storage unit, for example. There are storage cells, so if I type storage, then you, you can kind of see like from uh, from around here to like here is all the same mod, and we're currently just looking at the small one, so like the 1K ME storage, the maybe a 4K ME storage component, because they're just made of the same components. But all what you require for that is some redstone, a logic processor, a some service quartz and that's it pretty much so that is what we're going to try and make for that we need to get some a logic processor for which I need some more silicon for which I have to smelt some more I have to pulverize some more sand I'll just do one of them for now and then put the cobblestone back in to just let it make a shit ton of sand Nice. Put this in here. Put the silicon. It's not the silicon press. This is the silicon press. Here we go. And then this one, this one, and then just the redstone. Pick up another block of redstone. Just convert it back into normal redstone. Now place it in there. Yeah, logic processor. That's how you make one. And besides that, we needed some of that stuff that I already have in my inventory. Cool. So grab this one, do it like this, and we have the M, the one K ME storage component. And when we try to put it into the ME drive, it's gonna give us an error because, as you can see, it doesn't do anything. Because what we have made, we've made a storage component. We have not made a storage drive. We've made like the the outside or more like the chip that actually stores the data on the USB stick rather than the entire like infrastructure around it. To get that infrastructure, we're going to need to get one of these ME storage housing. And there's five of them. Essentia is probably from a different mod, the gas, the fluid, the advanced, and the ME storage. I have no idea what the difference is between these two. I think these guys can handle more or something. But all we need for that is two quartz glass, some redstone, and some iron ingots, which we have. I think we have enough in our inventory to make one of these. We have. And then all what you do is you put them together in a crafting table or in this case a tinker table but it's pretty much the same thing and you get a 1k ma storage cell and what this does this generates a achievement called better than chests and now all you have to do is you have to get grab the usb stick and put it in there so oh. here we go and as you can see it's lining up green there's three colors green orange and red when it's green, it's like there's plenty of space. When there's orange, it's like eh, you're kind of running out of space. And when it's red, it's like I'm sorry, I'm totally full. I can't do anything anymore. Right. So all that we need now is to get our stuff and dump it in there. As you can see, it has used 24 out of 63 times, and it has used 213 out of 124 bytes. And this way, you can pretty much just put all your items just in there so let's say I would grab this chest I would just grab a bunch of stuff I would go here and I would just smack it all in there as you can see it is offline because it is I think it's not getting enough power or maybe it is maybe it just takes a little bit of time to process it I do not know could be a mix of them 
But anyways, this way you can just store all your stuff in there. As you can see, it's filling up nicely. There we go. Now, now, now I'm getting a lot of different items, so I think it's gonna fill up very fast now. Yeah, it's almost filled up now. But we've cleared this entire, entire blah, blah, this entire chest already. Good, that thing broke. I did not need that anyways. So we're just going to grab more stuff and just dump it in there and as you can see it will fill up now. As you can see it's not picking up any of this stuff anymore because as you can see it's orange, it's simply full. And as we pick this drive up and we go back into this, everything is gone and that's because this item, this storage cell is not in the ME drive. It's like having a loose USB stick around but when you plug it back in then you have access to your stuff again. But that's why you need a permanent infinite power source because you can't have like if you're in the middle of doing something and your power runs out because you're for example working in the nether and then your entire system sold out you have no access to your items anymore so always leave like an extra chest with enough stuff to at least generate some backup power so that you can grab your most valuable stuff from the ME system for now it's not such a big deal to have that extra security because I don't have enough storage yet but I will be building more of that. But at least we have our ME system set up and as you can see everything just works very nice. There's the different cells that you can use, you can search, you can do a lot of things with it. I generally like to sort on the items that I have most of it to the items that I have least of it. And yeah, that's just it's just a very nice way to store all your stuff. Because if we make like two or three of those not a 1k ones, you can probably have most of these chests just gone. Because as you can see, this chest is almost empty as well. With like the same goes for these two. So we're pretty pretty filling we're it's a pretty pretty good way to fill up your entire like chesting systems, I'd say. So, anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to let me know in the comments below and i hope to see you guys in the next video bye oh this new crazy mother